shining stars of hope. That is how the five young women killed in that crash are being remembered tonight. Sammy Selena continues our team coverage. In this tough times, remember you are loved. They were loved. They were loved in our community. At the Dar al Farouk Islamic Center, grief fills part of the room. She was my sister. I loved her like my sister. <laughs> Love fills the rest. All five were part of the family here. Sahra Gaysade, Salma Abdul Qadir. So for Salma Abdul Qadir, uh, was one of our teachers. Uh, had a class, uh, you know, of 20, almost 20, uh, 25 to 30 students. Sagal Hirsi, Siham Adhan, Sabrin Ali. A few weeks ago, graduated from Indiana High School. I think right now our, our biggest focus is the families. Abdullahi Farah and Halid Omar are leaders here. Uh, it was tough, uh, you know. You know, these are uh, the parents that, you know, that we met with. The parents that we met with today were, uh, were, you know, part of our community. They told us the names of these women and received pictures from their families. It's about making sure that their, their history, their memories are honored in the right way. They were, you know, people who were volunteers, who were teachers, who were you know, who are all successful in finishing high school, going to college. But your pain is real and your pain will be there. Clearly, these young women loved one another. Leaders told us they were best friends, celebrating an upcoming wedding the night they died. Today, their community comes together to mourn. One is a tragedy. And that grief comes from how much they were all loved. All five of them will be missed. Just another way to see how much these women meant to their community. A campaign through LaunchGood has already raised more than $225,000. We have information on that campaign on care11.com. Morgan.